Here we go. The 2004 Tyler Lee Red Raiders come in here at number 11, right outside the top 10. Uh, they went 12 and 3 on the year. Uh, they lost to Lufkin 44 to 33. They lost to Longview 34 to 31, and they lost to. Uh, they had one more loss on the year. Who else did they lose to? Lost to U.S. Trinity 42-39. And those losses aren't anything to sneeze at at all. Those are real quality opponents that they played at your U.S. Trinity, of course were gods walking around Texas at that time. Lufkin in 2004 is one of the most impressive teams ever. Longview on the same note. So no shame in losing to those opponents, but they killed everybody else. Um, so if you take those three games out, they pretty much destroyed everybody else. The closest game they played was in the state championship game, 28-21. to 21. Everybody else got killed by more than 10 points. Uh, they beat Spring Westfield December the 11th, 2004 uh, in Houston. I don't think it was in Houston. I don't know where that game was played at. But nonetheless, they beat Spring Westfield 28-21. to Tyron Ross was the, the main catalyst that year on offense in 2004. He was a, a four-year dude for them. He ran every single year. Went over 1,000 uh, sophomore, junior, and senior year. Uh, defensively, Jason Stripling made the most plays. He went to Washington State. He made back-to-back -back weeks and back-to-back -back weeks in the state semifinal and the state championship game. This guy had a pick six. And so he was uh, very clutch for them that year. Uh, quarterback that year, I believe his last name was Hill. No, his stats aren't very good because they didn't throw the ball a whole lot. The, the playbook isn't, and that's what you notice when you see these highlights about, uh, on these early 2000 teams. They're just not as evolved as they are now. But he threw a really good football. His stats might not have been very good, but from the highlights and from the game, the game management, and how good the, the zip that's on the ball, he threw a really good football. So I think his name was Josh Hill that played quarterback that year for him. Uh, but Tyler Lee shows up here, uh, and they're right outside the top 10 talent-wise. You know, they're in the top 10 maybe, but, you know, you lose the two teams. And maybe, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Maybe I, maybe I got them on the slider, but when you guys see who's in the top 10, maybe you might see exactly what I'm talking about. But none of